bit of knowledge is now about Bell Book and Candle, right? And this is a very interesting code, Bell Book and Candle, right? And if you look at it, it's BBC, right? like the BBC Broadcasting Corporation, right? Bell Book and Candle, right? And this is a, a, a method of excommunication, right? Which is an act of religion or whatever, right? Anathema. Is someone or something detested and shunned, right? A creature set apart for sacrificial offerings. So you know, think about how that relates to what the teas uh, do to the naturals and all that, right? And the scapegoat thing, you know, this, obviously the scapegoat thing. Right? So it's a very interesting code, this. Yeah, introduced by poor Zachary. And obviously they use Zach a lot, like Zach Efron and stuff like that, so I like the Zach. And yeah, the right was once used by Roman Catholic Church. Um, excommunication. So basically it's a weird it's, this is an outline and a code and metaphor of what to do to naturals in the society, in the royal society. There's a lot of code in that there, like if you can read. In the name of God, the Lord, powerful Father, Son, Holy Ghost, Blessed Peter, Prince of the Apostles, binding and loosing. If they unbind us, we exclude from the bosom of Holy Mother, Mart, declare him excommunicated, judge him condemned to eternal fire with Satan and the reprobates, reprobate, so long as he not burst the fetters of the demon, mortify his body. See, so deliver a sort of isolate, like ice, I-C-E, ice, isolate, yeah, from this society, see, yeah, excommunicate, yeah, it means that, you know, communication is obviously like the code language they're speaking, so if you're excommunicated, you can't understand the code language, <coughs> fiat. Obviously, a fiat cause, and fiat money, right? So be it. Ring a bell. Holy book. Snuff out their candles. The metaphor, see? Snuff out their candles. So it's, this is the Royal Society. We're yeah, uh, dealing with naturals in their Royal Society. Who had no communications? The target. Unbelievable, eh? Yeah, the ritual were calculated so as to strike terror. When you strike a bell, see, you strike terror in the ones excommunicated. You bring them to repentance. The sinner, the single gender, see. So it's outlining this T system. Outline in their tea system the way they did. Shakespeare, of course. King John. Like King Solomon did. Bell book and candle shall not drive me back. And gold and silver begs me to come on. Bell book and candle. West. Thomas Beckett. Rolling Stones Winter. Goat's Heads. See? The scapegoat ritual. Exile on Main Street. Again, exile on Naturals. Bell Book and Candle. <coughs> John Lennon, see? It's all the codes against naturals. 
tetragrammaton, no, see, yeah, in the holy name of God. Witchcraft. It's Catherine Bell's Cassandra. Catherine Bell is Cassandra. Cassie. <laughs> Castrated, is it? Zeddy Reader. See, excommunication. She can't read. The Reader. Angels and electricity. Keeping a spirit or ghost to bear. The Holy Ghost. The superstition of all ghosts and spirits and that, see? The bell, book and candle. <clears throat> so a lot of code in this uh, idea, this particular idea, like. But in this, on a theme, as you teach, you some, so not someone detested or shunned, you Um, creature or object set apart for sacrificial offering made the scapegoat and thus removed from ordinary use and destined instead for destruction. So it's describing the way they treat the naturals in the in a royal society. That's the way it works. This is all a, a code and metaphor for for reality. An offering. Enemies and their weapons. See, they hear naturally. See, let him be anathema. Anathema sit. Dear not a song by James. Sit down, wanna sit down. Anathema sit. Make a dog. <laughs> Make a dog sit. Southwick. The south is the bottom there uh, thing again, see so pointing downwards. South. Barn from profound use. Portion. This favor of God, see? This favor of God. <clears throat> There's a movie right, with James Stewart. Yet again, James Stewart, read. Right? It's a pretty uh, a witch, Bell Boot and Cardinal Spell. Excommunication and spells. See? Reader, Eddie Reader.
Jangan sungguh. Jangan sungguh. She's a queen. That's the spell. James Stewart. Janus rule, Janus rule, Janus is rule. Productions, ship, a dog, down ship. John Wilkes, the Down Ship. Queenie. And the Zuriak Club. Zuriak is armor. See Zuriak is armor, isn't it? Zuriak animals. Twelve animal signs. Casting the spells, I think. See, bell, book, and candle. Bell, book, and candle. Down, down, south. Down ship. BBC Blue Peter. See, Blue Peter. Ship. Down. Always the goods. Bell, book, and candle. Is a ship, right? A ship is a ship. Dialect spelling of ship. Ship shepherd. A shepherd and a sheep. And a ship. A shepherd and a sheep. The blue Peter. A ship and a ship. Get down. <laughs> To the dog, book and candle ritual. And there's the Latin, Latin and the English, the Blessed Peter, the Blessed Peter mortify his body. No hex and spells by this BBC bell, book and candle. See, eh? I was casting out spells by it. BBC, the Bell Book and Candle. Modern story or new uh, modern story. A ship was the pilot of his own spaceship. So ship and ship is the same type of thing, right? Spaceships and ships and maritime, maritime uh, law and all that thing. Eh? So it's interesting, really. You've got a, a ship dog in both um, British and American culture type of thing. You see this one, the, the, the British one to replace Patch one of Petra's puppies. So there's your Peter again, right? And Pete Petra died in 77. Little Peter presenter John Nooks, right? And you have what also one in the American culture, which is a, a herding dog. In uh, this time, see? So that